So Xbox just announced that they're about to have a new games showcase on June 12th with Bethesda. All right. Now, this article is straight from the Xbox blog, website, post, whatever you want to call it. It just dropped at 6 a.m. today. And it's just a, a little newsletter that they're just informing us that on June 12th, they're going to have a game showcase. All right, and you know, just to read what it says today, we're excited to announce that the Xbox and Bethesda Game Showcase will stream on Sunday, June 12th at 10 a.m. Pacific time. This show will feature amazing titles coming from the game Xbox Game Studios, Bethesda, and our partners around the world. The Xbox and Bethesda Game Showcase will include everything you need to know about the diverse lineup of games coming soon to the Xbox ecosystem, including upcoming releases to Game Pass on Xbox and PC. The Xbox and Bethesda Game Showcase will be streamed on a variety of outlets in over 30 languages. You can choose where you want to tune in, and they got links to, you know, different social media sites. And how do I feel about this? Well, there's no E3 this year. I don't know if I covered that in a previous video, but there's no E3 this year. So now we're just relying on Nintendo, Sony, and Microsoft to put out their own uh, videos, show showcasing the games for this year and for the future and off rip um i have a feeling the games that's going to be dominating this showcase are mainly bethesda games uh basically starfield is supposed to drop later this year so i could definitely see them doing uh sh you know probably like a 30 minute in-depth look at starfield if it's gonna come out this year hopefully you know i don't want to you know, bet on it because we all seen what happened with Cyberpunk and multiple other games, including Zelda. So I'm not going to hold my breath on it. But if it is supposed to release, I want to see some gameplay. Okay, so I'm hoping and expecting to see some type of gameplay since this game been in development for so many years. Um, Redfall, I want to see, I know there was some leaks of a build going around that was unfinished, but I would like to see probably a tiny bit of gameplay, maybe like a quick montage just to get an idea and sense of the game since the first time we seen it was a cinematic trailer. I'm trying to think what other games we could see from Bethesda, but off the top of my head, I can't really think. Maybe some surprise announcements, maybe a follow-up to Prey or uh, Dishonored. But I'm not expecting gameplay for that. Uh, let me see. I'm trying. I'm sorry. I'm really trying to think. But uh, other games that they could show possibly, Forza. Forza Seven has to be coming soon. They're work. They've been working on a new engine. The game been delayed. So I want to say gameplay for Forza since we only got a trailer last time. Fable. I want to see a, maybe a montage of gameplay in it with some you know cinematics and stuff i just don't think that game is fully ready at this point maybe something with perfect dark and i'm pretty sure that uh sonora sacrifice or sonora or you know the follow-up game to hellblade <laughs> the hellblade sequel will be having some more in-depth gameplay because the first time we've seen it it was gameplay from what they said but I want to see, like, you know, maneuvering the land, maneuvering the world. So I'm expecting to see that right there. Outside of that, maybe some updates on Halo and future seasons. And I really can't think off the top of my head any other games. I know Microsoft acquired a whole bunch of stuff and IPs and properties. Maybe something with Wolfenstein. And I know they have all the partners and... You know, you're going to see some third-party games and, you know, uh, multi-platform games. But this is good. I don't know about Sony at the moment, and I don't know about Nintendo on if they're going to release something around that time frame since this is around the time E3 will come out. Also, you're going to see a Summer's, uh, Summer's Game Fest. So I also expect to see Microsoft there, but I feel like they're going to save all the heavy hitter games for june because last year for e3 they had uh they probably had one of the better they had to me they had the best um showcase out of all the companies 
It was gameplay, gameplay, games, 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 gameplay, gameplay, gameplay. And, you know, it opened up with trailers for upcoming games. So, hopefully we get to see more of those upcoming games and actual game footage. Alright? If you guys like the video, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification button to stay notified. I'm out. Stay safe.